today I want to show you around a little website that's super helpful. I wish this had existed when I was starting out in cybersecurity. Three minutes on the clock, and let's roll. This is the website of the UK's Cybersecurity Council. And don't worry, the stuff that's being talked about here largely applies to pretty much everywhere in the world. Sure, there's a few UK specific companies or things listed, but you get the idea. And it's a really nice site. You can go and explore all of it. They got, you know, loads of pages, but there's three here that I really want to show you. One is this cyber career framework. So this sort of breaks it down into 16 cybersecurity specialisms. These aren't flawless, by the way. I don't really see cybersecurity as these 16 things in my experience is a little bit different, but it's pretty good. It is pretty good. And if you click into one of these, let's take cyber threat intelligence. It says it's the assessment, validation and reporting of information on the current and potential cyber threats to maintain an organizational situational awareness. Here's the page on CTI. Working life gives you a little description as to what you might do as a CTI specialist on a day-to-day -day basis. What responsibilities you might have. I see key terms jumping out here. TIP, TTPs, IOCs, good stuff. Job titles you might look for some salary information. Obviously these are UK salaries. You could go and find US, China, Brazil, Africa, whatever it is, you can go search for your country. Glassdoor and LinkedIn are great tools for that. Knowledge, what sort of core knowledge a CTI specialist might have, what skills they might need. Moving on, so where you might go after being a CTI specialist, that's quite cool. And if you're new to cyber entirely, you might not have any idea where to even start. So entry routes is quite a good thing. And here's some of the online resources. As you can see, try hack me, Amazon, Cisco, Hacker One, IBM, SANS, Offsec, Hack the Box, all the good stuff is on here. There's boot camps on here. I believe a lot of these are UK boot camps, but Maybe you can get onto them from other countries. Entry level certifications. These are some good entry level certs. I don't see Security Plus or Network Plus on here, but everything else looks pretty good. And there's a really cool career mapping tool. So you answer some of these questions. So how confident are you at authentication, authorization and accountability, some knowledge, adversarial behaviors, advanced knowledge, cryptography, and based on your answers, it gives you jobs that you might be really well suited to. Network monitoring and intrusion detection is 100% match for me. CTI is 87. I did click through some of those quite quick. So if you're someone who's coming from another part of the technology world, maybe you're in like the IT world or the help desk world and you want to try and get into cyber, you could fill out that form because you might know a lot of those things and then it would direct you to this page where you can then go and read about network monitoring and intrusion detection, what a day in the life is like, etc. So that's the UK CSC website, pretty cool. And if you're trying to get into cybersecurity and you've questions, leave a comment below, I'll get back to you. See you next week.